Welcome back, everybody. More Oakdale City Skyline 2. And I found some oil. So, naturally, we're going to get it. So, let me build a road. We'll continue this road, I should say. Um, I think if I do something like... First off, connect these two. And run you down here. That's not what I wanted. I didn't want a bendy road at all. I wanted a straight road. Straight road. So hey, before I continue with this mess, um, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, use the link in the description for freecash.com. Use that link gets you three loot boxes that have up to $250 in them each. They're quite lovely. Um, we're going to have to put these cables underground. So let's do that right now. Actually, we'll pop up here. Grab this. Go under. To there. Uh, and then I have to delete that. Let's see if this other one's going to actually turn on. It's not. It didn't connect. Let me try again. So we'll start above. We'll start here. And then we'll go under. And I'll go like this. Like this, like that. There we go, that did the power. So now we can delete you. There we go. Problem solved. Now let's get the oil. Derek's down. Uh, A driving advisory here? has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise caution if you must drive, well, um, and try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. This has been a local public service announcement. A driving advisory has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Okay. Please exercise caution if you must That's drive, better. and try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. This has been a local public service announcement. You're listening to Second Moon, the station for the cultural sophisticate who doesn't fear extending their ears to the more challenging sphere of the classical genre. Let us move now from the uh, musical page to the literary. Mm -hmm. Here we have some perfectly anguishing correspondence from a listener. My dear Professor Hornbuckle... <laughs> Whereas I make no apology for my erudite, uh, modesty demands that I prevaricate against the title. I am but a humble devotee of the form, and all my expertise derives merely from a life devoted to the gentle arts. Though I do thank you for the honor, mm. uh, but I digest to continue. Uh, Professor Hornbuckle, as a traveler from my homeland, I long to hear a tune that speaks to the anguish of my road-weary soul. Hmm. Road-weary soul. There now, my good soul. fellow, chin up, as it were. No need to wallow in sediment. Leave that to those poet chaps, eh? Here's a tune just for you, and I do hope it provides your aching spirit some modest desolation. For our feature story, we're on the streets with Kim this hour, taking the pulse items. of the city. So, Kim, what's the word on the street? Tell us what you're hearing. It's more what I'm smelling, Glenda. I have to say, it just plain stinks around here. Gross. Oh, man. And these concerned citizens agree. That's hardly news. There hasn't been any trash collection. Get out of here. Long. There's rotting food, dirty diapers, fish guts, and... Oh, God, I, I, I can't stand the think about it, let alone smell it. And the piles of filth just oh keep my goodness. growing and okay. growing and There's, growing there, yeah. and growing. <laughs> He's mad. Doomed. You heard it here, folks. We're not doomed. 
It's still pretty stinky, though. That's good to hear, Kim. We'll be back after this. We'll just, uh... And on to our main feature story. Grab all this. The commercial district is booming, as the area is attracting more high-end stores, bringing the latest in luxury to our neighborhood. You can now shop for designer shoes while sipping a fancy local Jarva Mate. Jarva so Mate. That's good for business and good for the community. There we go. Thanks, Jim. We'll be back after this. Water damage. Let me fix that problem. Uh-huh. There we go. Okay. Destroyed by flooding. It's okay. That'll fix over time. So we have some stuff here. We need to industrialize the areas here. And I've decided I am actually going to do another big incinerator. Um, I'm just going to put it right here. Why do I just upgrade this one? No, this will increase our our actual burning ability. So you need to have one of these. There it is. And you don't need truck depots. You need these guys. Okay, that's good. It needs to be connected to power. So I have to put you in underneath. There we go. And now it will produce power and garbage. 1650 garbage to be exact. And all 20 trucks go out to collect the mass amount of garbage we have to burn. We're producing some more stuff. Um, I don't know how to deal with this. I don't want to bulldoze that object. Hmm. Pathways. Interesting. Well, there's in and out of here, so you can get in and out. So, yep, that's fine. There was another industry I wanted to make. Um, is it a farm? Textiles. I think it's grain that my uh, stats wanted me to make. Oh boy, where, where is that button here? Production. Yeah, it's grain. We use a lot of textiles, but we're also importing all of it. The grain import is getting up to a thousand, so that's kind of nuts. We're actually exporting a ton of the of oils. So that's making everybody rich. Super rich. Petrochemicals, we're making a lot. Still importing a lot. That's gasoline, I think. Yeah, look at all the stuff. Just importing, exporting. So the town doesn't export a lot. Software. We got some software business going on. It's great. Look at this mess. This is, uh... What? Where? Oh my. These are people moving in? Oh crap. 300. My goodness. My goodness. That's a... Uh, that's a traffic jam and a half. Road maintenance vehicle. Look at them all. I mean, it's a lot of people coming from the highway, and they're going into the city, and a lot of people coming from the city. Oh my goodness. Where are you going? 
Destination. Need electronics. Oh, they're commuting into the city. So there's only one way to fix that problem. Subways. The Great International. Take the subway from in here out to there. So first off, we're going to do a subway for every hub. So we'll just uh, throw one there. Uh, there's got to be one here. Can I put it right here? That's the most perfect space ever. There's a hub down here. This is the places where people want to go. And there'll be one here. Okay. And then what I'll do... People can walk from everywhere else. I'm going to put one from here being the main hub. Out. Just walk across the street. Walk up the street. Walk down the street. I'll have to put parking here too. Yeah, that's going to exist. This will be the main, this will be the exit. Exit hub will go... Um, I'm going to slap one in here. We'll have something over here. So people do work here. And then into where these office buildings are. I'll have to put the last one. I'll have to be left to right. Um, probably here. It's as close as I can get it. Okay, now we'll need double track. Let's go underground, please. And we'll just build this track out. Yeah, okay, here we go. Now we do bendy. Um, yeah, you can just you can just bend over here. And bend on in. There we go. Seven. Okay. Go here. Start bending. And then we'll bend on into here. There we go. Now you, sir. Come out. work. Kind of like stuck or something. Okay. Come out. Bend. There we go. Okay, I think I've got it. And you're just going to go... There we go. Now. You, sir. I'm gonna go over here. get up to here.
What? What's it overlapping? Excuse me. Is that up one? No. There we go. Wow. It's got to come down. I'm going to come all the way over here, so just do a little bendy action. connect out here so you gotta come out here connect it's not connecting there we go that didn't connect oh yeah it did but no pedestrian access tunnel okay so now we have our trains. Let's start by connecting the trains. Yeah. It just goes in a circle all day long. Ta da! Now you. Need to go a driving here. advisory has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise here. caution if you must drive and try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. This has been a local public service here. announcement. A driving advisory has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise caution if okay. you must drive and try to stay off the streets until now, conditions improve. Now can I make another improve. route? This has been a local public service announcement. That was true. Um, I think they they cross You're listening to Second Moon Radio. Tracks, I'm not sure. Tastes. Don't touch that dial. This is a really long route. <clears throat> um, our story this hour. Kim is on scene outside and uh, abandoned building. That's right. Okay, Jim. whatever. This decaying shell is a symbol of the industrial decline sweeping the city. People are being laid off. The industrial Perfect. sector is on the verge of collapse. And worrying <laughs> they cross. is on the rise. <laughs> Thanks, Kim. Um, Always gotta watch out for it happens. What are these taxis? Buildings. We'll have more after this. While we're not in the business of reporting rumors. There's a okay, so now the trains are running. ...that an insidious underground criminal organization has seized control of the area. Criminal Recent crime stats confirm that the crime wave has certainly gripped our region, and it's showing no signs of letting up. I don't like the sound of that, Glenda. We'll be back after this. Put a parking garage near every one of these. You don't fit. And then that way, we'll have... Oh, is there not... There is a train station here, okay. That way, if you gotta go drive to the train station, you can always park somewhere. Beautiful. If you ever had to drive here, you can park here. And I do need to make a fire station here, I think. to solve that problem. Police station. Man. The police don't come up here. They don't go there. They don't go over here. 
They don't go over here. So I probably should police this up. Where did I put the uh, station? There you go. Police power. Yeah, we're just going to need more police in various places. I have a police headquarters. Um, yeah, which is here, and it doesn't even protect this area, so... I'll have to put one in here, too. You can't go there? There you go. Need a police station here, too. Um, some of these buildings aren't actually done, so... There you go. It's better. I have, like, no money. Your fire covered, covered. Okay, so for fire, we're covered. Clinics were covered. Crematoriums. I think I only have three up here. Which probably isn't enough. If you're waiting for hearses here and there. There you go. Crematorium. Everyone likes that. It's making our costs go way up. Our population is going up too. And we actually got some more space we can buy. So. Yeah, look at all the mess. Just so much. Even though I got this new. Hold on. We got this new uh, incinerator. It doesn't seem to matter. It's full already. Oh my goodness. I might need just a massive landfill somewhere. I don't really want to make one though. Like, I could put a infill here or something. I guess I'm gonna have to buy all this land. Just to uh, sprawl some more. How we go into the middle. How we can go up and over. Um, Alright, so I know I need to be leveled up. I need to get this for ore. So yeah, we'll go this way. I don't have the money for this. Okay, we'll purchase split permits. And then let's have a look at our ore. Oil. There's an oil deposit here. Wow, really? There's an ore deposit right here. So we want to use this. So I'm going to have to convert all this to, uh, to industrial ore production. I'm basically a big old mine. So what do we do? We, um... Rip some of these streets down. There we go. I think they'll do it. All these houses can go. Because all the zoning is gone. And now we can do our ore. Ore mining. Here we go. So that's going to be off of roads that go right here. There we go. So that's where it's going to be. Um, this is on a giant hill. So it only makes sense to put the ore mining on here. This has to be dezoned. I uh, will have to dezone something probably like this. Actually, probably this whole section. Uh, most likely this whole section too. There's going to be industrial in here. There we go. And we'll go back to our ore mining. It's 
against all this too. But why are you... Why are you rezoned? Should be dezoned. Get out of your houses. Okay. Uh, yeah, go here. You just can go around the circle that you can work. It's all this. There you go. That's one. And number two is going to be over here. Actually, I'm going to put you here. Uh, yeah, I'm going to put you here. The road's going to come up this way. Up the road to this other one. Okay. And we'll just go around as deep as we can go. get all the ore out of this mountain. There you go. Now you need a road. I'm actually going to put a roundabout in there. I'm going to put a road here. Yes, this will be our very large mining operations. With uh, basically nothing else in there. You can put, I don't know, commercial or something. There's actually a need for some commercial, so I will put a little bit down. We'll see what it builds. A food station. Alright, so if we have the need for offices, I will do exactly that. Offices. Um... Yeah, it's fine. Assessing you for office is done. Commercial. This is high density commercial. I'm trying to intensify the whole area. And we need some high density residential as well. Which, I mean. Intensifying around all these areas is something I want to do. There you go. Intensified. This is all unused. We have more need for commercial. wants to live here. <laughs> I could put a um, little bit of commercial in here somewhere. Oh no, there's some. Yeah, it's fine. Well, um, I'll put one of these blocks as commercial. And I'll make some commercial here too. Around that parking lot. We can plop some commercial. 
O timer. Wow, that time went quick. Put some more commercial around here. Run that guy too, and here. So we have a lot of industrial requesting happening. Don't exactly know where to put it. But we also have that new building. So this is a food station. Well-being and attractiveness. Where do I put it down here? Yeah, like right here. So they didn't like it, but it makes everything else nicer there. Beautiful. So we have a major industrial need right now. Don't exactly know where to put it. It's probably going to be... Wow. I put a big old fatty farm right there. Could put one there. Not going to. I think I'll just get one off of this road here. We'll, uh... Pull an exit off. Look at this mess. A driving advisory has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise caution if you must okay. drive and try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. This has been a local public service announcement. A driving advisory has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise caution if you must drive and try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. This has been a local public service announcement. What kind of future does music have if it doesn't look to its past? Well, I say the question speaks for itself. Here on Second Moon, we know you can't move forward unless you keep both eyes steadily trained on what's behind you. A housing shortage is driving up prices in the area. That's right, Glenda. But apparently, that's not all good news. We're joined today by an expert guest, Professor Nutbutter. Welcome, Professor. So a housing shortage is bad for the people trying to move here, right? Humans are programmed to desire certain representations within ideological reward structures, which are entirely apart from the actual reward. Entirely apart. For example, do something like this. Right, well, one final question, Professor. Is the housing Just shortage throw this going in to make here. me richer? By certain metrics, perhaps, yes, in the short term. I like the sound of that. But what we are discussing is the study of a statistical abstraction and its effect on the human Thank psyche. you, Professor. It is a question of priority. We're, yeah, we're this one covers the uh, whole and thing. We're getting reports about a traffic accident. Uh, somewhere uh, in the city. Road maintenance services have already been dispatched and traffic flow should return to normal. But if you're planning a quick trip out, you might want to wait a little while until everything clears up. If you're in it, you, uh, you already know about it. No use reminding you. Meanwhile, uh, expect delays and drive safe. Oh no. I've made a horrible mistake. Oh no, I didn't. Nice. Just needs power, and then we're good. Power goes right to there. Overlapping items. What's going under? Over overlapping. Oh, it's the pipes. There we go. Power instilled. So now we have a farm. Doing farm work. Uh, there's an in and out in here. Uh, wait a second. I have an in and an in. I have no out. Crap. Okay, there's one out. <laughs> um, I need an out going north. Up. 
Okay. Um, unfortunately, we won't be able to go. I have to split this thing. And then oh, go there and then go down. Merge. And then you come here. Nope. There we go. And merge. What a mess. What a mess. So you can get out going south. If you want to go north, you can go that way. You can go this way. Um... If you're going north, though, you have no way to get over. So, I'm going to need one more split. And this is going to have to be on grade 10. And then come down. There we go. Now you can go every direction. Oh my goodness. Can I turn that into a roundabout? Wouldn't that be amazing? Uh, hold on. Hold, hold the phone here. Let me see if I can turn this into a roundabout. Can't quite. Um, except if I pause... And just... Give us a little more space. Um, I would like to put the roundabout. It would be okay there. It's gonna be big though. Check this out. Check this out. in the air or what? Okay. Second roundabout? No. Mm. What if... No, the roundabout doesn't make any sense. Because you can't go around it. It's a one-way. Never mind. Um, I've destroyed my highway for no reason. Okay. So you... Do something like that. Continue. Now we take our one ways. Go up. Okay. Now you come out. Go down there. This is starting to move again. Now I need an entrance. There you go. So somebody can come in here. And also put uh, a single house. Maybe two if someone wants to move in. Hey, he's actually taking the other way around. Pull the Yui. Uh, what's the other way I can fix this highway? This is insane. This is people coming from over there. I just need the second entrance. Uh, to the land. It's so like... A second entrance across the bay here. Because right now there's only one way in. And that's not... That's not exactly great. So, that's gonna do it for this episode. I'm, I'm gonna think about how to fix this mess. I don't really know if you have a suggestion i mean you can message me on comments 
and we can see. I might have to... Oh, look at all the cars in this. Insane, insane thing. There's even a car accident all the way down here. On this highway. Which is a bridge in the valley. Houses as far as I can see. No trash pickup. Because our landfill doesn't exist. It wasn't big enough. I could... I guess I'm going to have to make a big fat landfill. Like a big landfill. Because I don't think there's any special resources here. No, there's nothing else. I mean, there's trees, but... It's fine. There's actually more oil here. Which is in the way. There's oil all over the place. I don't need wood. There's oil over here too, which is really nice. Wow. Oil here too? There's oil kind of all over the place. It's oil rich land. It's crazy. Alright, well, I'll see you the next one. We'll pause. We're uh, still losing money. A lot of money. <laughs> Tons of services. Gonna have to find a way to get more more on services or raise taxes. I don't really want to raise taxes, but we're also getting office demand, which is nice. Hmm, look at all the money we're making from electricity. Hello. Could I raise the electricity fees? Doesn't affect happiness, but does affect efficiency. Education's making us money too. Wow. Actually made eight hundred thousand from this thing. This is schools, college, universities that provide education. It's probably mostly from the university. I go and find that thing. You. No dropout rate. Upkeeps two hundred forty thousand. I guess that's schools too. It's just schools everywhere. I think I'm operating. Yeah, if I just click on schools here. Hmm, we have a lot of people. So, we have lots of elementary schools capacity. So, we're doing fine there. University, only a thousand are going. Out of 4,000 eligible. And then. You can kind of see everybody. I don't have any research facilities. Education coverage. Yeah, so we only have one college. Which can't get everybody going where they need to. So if I if I add another college or two. Um very expensive. So is this. Can be upgraded. Technical University. Wow. Industrial Facilities. Medical University. Hello. Yeah, I gotta research this stuff. Anyways, we'll do it next time. See ya.